This device is called a Drodeo and it was designed in MIT in America. You can Google for Drodeo. It stands for draw plus audio because you are drawing with a pencil and it is making a sound. So draw plus audio makes Drodeo. You can Google this and then you can find the circuit and make one for yourself. You must be wondering what in this pencil is making that kind of sound and what are these other things on top of this pencil. So I'll try to explain to you what these are. There is a very interesting circuit on top of this. You see a speaker which is the most prominent part of this pencil and there are many other components like a capacitor, a resistor, one IC which is called a 555 IC and batteries. What this circuit does is that it checks the resistance between any two points and then it makes a sound which is proportional to the resistance that it sees. Now what is the resistance in this circuit? The resistance is measured between two points, between this wire and between this wire. This wire is connected to the pencil through this graphite inside it and as we all know that graphite is a conductor of electricity. So now if I connect this wire to the tip of this pencil, we will hear a very sharp sound, like this. This is the opened up Drodeo circuit. Now if I join this wire to the other end, it will make a sharp sound. Now this wire is connected to the graphite, graphite with the help of this push pin. And it is connected to the graphite till the end of this pencil. Now if I join the wire to the end of this pencil, it will also make a sharp sound. Now if I add some resistance between these two points, it will change the sound. For now, I will use my body resistance to make changes in the sound. So I will hold one end here and through my body, the other end will come here. Now the harder I squeeze the tip of the pencil, the sharper sound it will make. This shows that the sound changes with the resistance. Now we will see if water is conductive. I'll keep one tip of the pencil here and move my hand along this line of water. As you can see, the further I take my hand from the tip of the pencil, the frequency of the sound is decreasing. This shows that the resistance is increasing. So, the longer is the length of this resistance, the higher it is. We have all heard that human body is conductive. Now these children are demonstrating exactly the same fact to you that human body can carry current. 